Well, hello. Today was supposed to be a test of the Super Pioneer DA model, but we have a failure. We made some practice cuts because nobody's going to try this for real straight off. And a dismal little bit of uh, sawdust there. But the motor's bogging down at high revs and just uh, stopped. And now my arm is dropping off from pulling it over. So here's a little view of the machine. It seems like the longest restoration that I've ever uh, undertaken. Uh, we had to do a lot of swapping of parts. You can follow all the story on the blog. And uh, it just got a little shorty beaver tail bar on it. It's still not complete. Uh, I had to take the spike off for the test because the lower bolt there has uh, lost its threads inside the housing. Chain's hanging down a bit loose. That's uh, where it's nudged up and pulled it tight. It's not been used for who knows how long. Here we are at the starter end. Uh, I had to put the uh, new mesh to keep the sawdust out, the uh, recoil mechanism and uh, the magneto. We'll just turn her around. There's the remains of the Union Made sticker there. Not see many of those. And here we've got the uh, serial plate for the saw. That's a very nice little feature. Carburetor all cleaned up and uh, tuned as far as I thought, but we're not getting enough fuel flow at high revs so it's not able to uh, sustain a cut. It just uh, bogs down and, and then quits. And a little bit of detail here. I haven't bothered painting every single component. The gearbox uh, got a, a coat of what looked like reasonable color paint. I quite like the faded red on these uh, first machines, so I left it at that. Otherwise, it starts to become a complete restoration. And I'm not sure I've got time for that. Anyway. That's enough of this. We'll send this off to the video experts and hope that we can uh, improve the saw cutting the next time round. Okay. Thank you.